This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Okay guys, uh, now first we have to download the script by visiting the link which I provide in the video description. So I have the link, I will paste it here. And now you will see this page. Welcome to Brian. To download this script first you have to subscribe the channel. Go to the next. Click and subscribe get the download link that's a simple way click to subscribe unlock the link here you can see a uh, confirmation subscribe and if you check checking this subscribe or not now you have successfully subscribed my channel back to our tab click to download when you click here you will see this script there now we will download this script click the download link so it's 33 mb so download anyway now we are downloading the script then we will see the extension process okay now my script is now downloaded successfully welcome to my youtube channel which is r y h m that's mean raihan in this channel i try to show php laravel wordpress script uh, and bug fix etc etc so today uh, we will see, uh, see how to install ptc lab with free which is obviously i will provide you the script i have been search a lot in the internet to get the uh, ptc lab uh, latest version or old version but there is no no I, I i i just fed up the this you can see lots of websites offering the script but when you try to install uh, download them they will show you lots of errors and make you just suffocated uh, you will lost your hope to get the script. This is my personal experience. So I will not do this to my beloved subscriber. Which are you now watching my video? Please carefully watch the video to get the proper installation and how to get the script. Obviously 100% free. I will not play the game or not any ads click not anything just follow my step to get the script and install it if you face any problem whenever you try to install please go to my community i will post the words uh, or something like that comment there and also i will solution provide the solution okay guys now i am uh, my Sip NL. Now let's start the process how to install PTC lab from on cPanel. So first we have to create a subdomain. You can also install in your uh, primary or main domain or another domain, but I will create a subdomain because I don't want I have not enough primary domain or another domain. So I will search for domain and get the domain. You can also browse uh, separately. Now create a domain. I will I will uh, untick the option so I don't want to share my root folder. I will create a subdomain ptc uh, two dot because I have another one. That's why I use two. 
my main domain okay now click submit so my subdomain is now created so let's jump into the folder so i am seeing cjbin on st dot stxs i will delete the both okay we have successfully download the script from the link so we will upload it to our a directory uh, this is now empty click upload folder zip file extract it here obviously here okay now it extracted so i will delete the zip folder i, I don't need this uh, document folder because i already read it i have the idea how to install so i will delete it now you will see the files enter the files now you will see the five uh, three folders and two files select click select all <coughs> hit the move button and remove the files because we will install the script on the subdomain so click on move so our files move to the our subdomain so you can now you can delete the also empty folder now i will visit my domain so it's showing me 500 error because i have also a folder installed after the subdomain slash install type install now you will see the interface like this this is just a uh, formalities they are one domain etc now click agree and next step so here <coughs> we have four steps server requirements so it's uh, php 3.4 or higher all extensions are is now okay now click next okay now it will uh, file permissions uh, it says we have the database available SQL and its access also available so we have to uh, give the permission five <coughs> folder first see it says for bootstrap catch go to for bootstrap catch make it carefully ch carefully check it says make it 0775 so if you click there now you can see 775 it's okay now if you confuse click recheck now you can see it's okay so i will make uh, other four at once because to consume the time make them permission 775 now i think all are okay now you can see all are okay click next step now it will installation information now this is my domain uh, it will ask for purchase code and the user username and purchase code type here my channel name and the 
purchase code you can type this okay now we need database details because we didn't still create the database go to cpanel type database so i will click mysql database wizard so i will make the database name ttc2 so i can indicate the subdomain with database name click next i also say keep this same use uh, ptc to same username you can also make it different but i like to username and database name same so it doesn't any make differences so i will create uh, so i will hit the generate password i will copy this password and tick mark here use password click create user check all privileges click make changes now you can see i have the user database user and database name also the both are same that not a problem so i will first paste the database password always database host is local host okay now i will copy the user because my user and database name is same so i will copy it once and paste there okay now in default my username is admin and password is also admin now you have to enter the email address of your admin so i will uh, provide a fake email address that's not a big deal uh, like uh, etc2 i have the right uh, gmail.com but if you seriously doing a business make sure you have to use your real email because it will help you to recover if you some somehow if, if you some if you somehow forget your password you will you can reset by the email address so now click the install now so you can see it says complete installations email address email address of the admin has been set successfully please delete the install folder from the server because if you hit the install it will go to the next step again like i if i show you the example so don't forget to delete the install folder I, now see this comes again okay now i will delete the install folder so that because we have already installed it we don't need this install folder okay now we can go to, uh, tab go to website and go to admin panel now we will log into admin panel remember our admin panel user and password was same admin and admin okay now click the login don't forget to change the admin password click admin click password so our existing password is admin now i will set a password for myself okay now save it uh, password does not match sorry I will try again maybe somehow okay now we will type existing password admin now I will set a password for myself confirmation password also should be 
save otherwise it will not save click the save it says password change successful now you have the all options here to say, make your website better uh want to watch my video please uh, subscribe my channel and also please like my video if you need any other kind of script wordpress plugin wordpress theme anything about website you can comment my video also go to my community and uh, comment there i will post here uh, what you need next you must go to there and comment your desire script name or wordpress theme or plugin anything you can comment there and i also make a video about rocket lms uh, free installation you will see the download link and you can also download the uh, rocket lms installation and uh, in this my video watch this video also i also provide the download link you can download from here uh, and also the show the full installation way how to install the rocket lms say this is 100% you can see my domain name and also subdomain name is 100% successfully i have installed thank you guys watching my video